County made a major change this past weekend when it comes to testing drunk driving suspects. Cumberland is now the only county in the state that can draw blood and test it. Allie got an exclusive behind the scenes look today. Allie. Well, Alicia District Attorney Dave Freed says in the long run this will save time and money, but DUI and defense attorneys aren't happy about it. This past weekend, three men were tested for suspected DUI in Cumberland County like none before them. A new county phlebotomist drew their blood at the prison booking center, and another part-time county employee tested it at the county's forensic lab. All three came back above the legal limit. In the long run, we're not paying for outside lab tests. We're not paying for the time of the people who've been involved in the testing to have to come into court and testify. That's a big problem for, for hospitals. And DA Dave Freed says it allowed police to get back on patrol faster during peak DUI hours. On, they're not sitting and waiting at the hospital. They're not transporting the person from the hospital to the booking center. One-stop shop gets them back out on the street doing their job. But DUI defense attorneys say the new process raises new issues. I worry about the qualifications, I worry about the chain of custody, and I worry about the supervision that's going to occur when you have what is a limited part-time lab. Defense attorney John Mank believes more suspects will refuse to take the test. Concerned results won't be independent. When county employees are taking and testing their blood, and it's essentially the county that's prosecuting them. No other Central Pennsylvania County has seen the need. No other Central Pennsylvania County has gone to the expense that we're doing as taxpayers in Cumberland County. Conspiracy theorists will never be satisfied, but the blood is drawn in a specific manner, uh, in a sterile environment, tested in a sterile, env sterile environment, as your photos here today will show, uh, and we're extremely proud of it. This will only be done during peak DUI hours, Friday night into Saturday morning and Saturday night into Sunday morning. Alicia, back to you. Have a good issue. Allie, thanks very much.